Well, in cities across the country, police and community members gathered for the annual celebration of National Night Out. It was a beautiful night for it. WGN's Christine Flores reports on the celebrations in Munster, Indiana. Oh, good evening. This wrapped up the 29th year of National Night Out here in Munster. It was an evening filled with food, fun, and family entertainment. I liked uh, how the um, in the parade, how the tenues uh, won, and like how they were coming down inside uh, of the parade, and it was cool because my brother's on that team. The 29th annual Night Out Against Crime celebration in Munster kicked off with a parade that included first responders, veterans, members of the U.S. Army, school groups, community organizations, and businesses. Uh, we've lived in Munster now the last seven years, so this is our seventh time coming. We love coming to this. The kids love it. The kids have been coming since they were little. On nights like tonight, it's all about community. I mean, that's one of our... we. Our 4th of July parade, that's a big community outreach event too, and we're just happy to, to be a part of such a great community. Its purpose is to promote positive police and community partnerships through an evening of fun. Residents were invited to show support for participants and even got some sweet treats. Candy. Yeah, I liked all the vendors and all how cool it is. It's like everything here. Like you can see everything. You can see a lot of stuff. The parade wrapped up around 5 o'clock, ending at the community pool for the main celebration complete with food, games, prizes, and a first-hand look at first responder tools such as fire trucks, police cars, and a helicopter. Well, police and community partnerships are very important to us in Munster, and we try to work really hard all throughout the year uh, to put a lot of effort into these kinds of programs to show the public that we care and that we are here when they need us. The evening wrapped up with the annual fireworks display. Well, this is an event that happens across the nation with the same goal of connecting our first responders with community members. For now, reporting in Munster, Christine Flores, WGN News.